Bienvenidos, damas y caballeros. Okay, thank you. Ladies and gentlemen, everybody, this is Dennis No Day. Hi, everybody. Dennis, before I even say anything else, Dennis is my trumpet teacher. Okay. And everything I know about trumpet, I attribute to him. And you won't hear any of it. But anyway, Good. Welcome, everybody. Thank you. I know about 85% of all of you. I want to say a few words just before dinner because they're about to call dinner and we can all stand up and chow down. Most everybody in the room, I say about 85%, I know. But you don't know each other, which is a unique thing because it's like my bar mitzvah. <laughs> I know all of you, and I know why you're here, and I know all kinds of stuff about you. Which was many years ago. <laughs> Particularly some clients sitting there. Yeah. And Danielle knows all of that too. Anyway, those of you who know me, know me very well, you know, uh, and I never make secrets about uh, my riding with Judy, and that connection as to why we're here for the lighthouse and all of those other nice things, I'll get into in a second. But, as a good pretext for throwing a party, it's my 50th birthday. Yay! There you go. And you will all have the distinct honor and pleasure of singing to me later. <laughs> and I will give you that, 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 uh, that honor, as it were. Everybody knows uh, who I've spoken to about this. I've been riding with Judy now about 11 years. Judy is my tandem partner. And uh, in the course of riding over about 11,000 miles, Judy knows pretty much all of you. Because we have four hours together when we ride. And there's only a certain amount of politics we can talk about. And the, so I wound up talking about my friends and my encounters and all the rest. So whether you know it or not, she knows you. Uh, and likewise, you know talk. her because I've talked to many of you about my experiences. So what I'm going to ask you to do, because she won't come up and introduce herself to you, in the course of the evening after dinner, and this is very embarrassing to her, I know, but what are you going to do? Come over and say hello to Judy. She's sitting right over here at the black table over here. Now... The Lighthouse, where she is a member, which is an organization which supports the visually impaired, we are supporting tonight. And this is the Alumni Association, if I'm not mistaken. Right, Judy? Okay. And they do uh, educational, uh, uh, advanced educational programs. They Maybe you want to tell us about it, Judy. But nonetheless, it's a good organization. Okay, there you go. And... We may even be able to get some computers in there. I don't know what's going to be the result of the evening, but as a pretext for having a party, this is actually a fundraiser. So I have no qualms about standing in front of you and making a big deal about my birthday. So, having turned 50 last week, with Maria, where is she? Maria and I share a birthday. Maria, you're going to come up and speak next, so be prepared. <laughs> That's right. Dennis, his signature song, as far as I'm concerned, is a song called Maria. From West Side Story. That's right, the West Side Story. If we can impose on him, maybe, just to hit the high notes, because that, let me tell you, I can't, no, I can't even hit the low note. Let them drink a lot for you. No, no, no. He hit the high notes in my, in my apartment where I take the classes, and it cleaned my windows. They, they vibrate. It was, it was great. Taxi <laughs> What's that, Mike? The, the checks to the lighthouse? Yes, absolutely. That's, party. This is a fundraiser. That's, that's right. Anyway, most of you know everybody here. We have one dignitary in the room. And as is customary, we have to recognize our one dignitary. His Honor, Judge Julio Gonzalez, is, uh, is, uh, has graced us with his choice today. And I thank you for coming. A long old friend of mine. And I thank you for being here, Julio. Huh? What's that? If I was six months older, this would have been a fundraiser for you. <laughs> All right. So as your cruise director tonight, I will tell you that there is in the room with us tonight uh, Gary Goodman. Where are you, Gary? Right there. There we go. Gary Goodman is our magician, a resident magician. Follow him around the room. He may make you disappear. He's very good. I've watched him. 
Outstanding. Okay. Gary, my wife is right here. Right here. Here's your next table, Gary. Dinner is over here. Creative. Creative Affairs is doing the catering tonight. We have cigars for outside. And by the way, it's a beautiful evening. I'm going to tape this door open. We can come in and out. The, the beach and patio right outside here. So make yourself comfortable. Cigars only outside. Yes. Double Chateau Maduro Rick. You're the man. There we go. I have the lighter. The one lighter. Did you bring a cutter? I did not bring a cutter. I have a cutter. <laughs> a cutter. Okay. We're covered. So we have cigars outside. Anybody who's interested in joining? What's that? Are you on oil? I'm oil. Uh, what else? Cigars, Creative Affairs, Gary Goodman, Dennis No Day, birthday cake, party, eat, drink. Have a good time. Yeah, happy birthday. If you have, if you remember, if you actually read the invitations, the check, the table for the checks is over yonder. If not, contact me. Uh, bring me a sealed envelope. I don't need to know what you're going to give. Oh, this is very, very important. At some point during the evening, somebody will ask you, hey, how much are you going to give? <laughs> I give you license to lie. You tell them whatever you're going to give, multiply it by four and tell them. Okay? God forgives you. I forgive you. But whenever that question comes across, hey, how much are you going to give? Well, same thing you do with my bills, yeah. <laughs> 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 very good, very good. All right. On that happy note, I thank you. All, I thank you all for coming tonight. The bar is designed to be empty, so please, by all means, and I trust that you all will have a very, very good time. I only do this once every 50 years, so okay. And remember, Judy's sitting right there. My pleasure. I'm never going to hear the Happy end of this. Happy birthday, Joe. Thank you. Thank you very much. Enjoy. Uh, any longer, and you've got to run for Congress. Okay. Oh, go I'm, for I'm it. You, I'm just going to give you short, a short day. Where's Barry? Barry Eichenberg. I, I need my Hollywood contingency over here. I'm, okay, here's how it works. It's going to take a second, then you can all eat. Every song ever written has been arranged and written and then performed. I need my Hollywood contingency over there to tell me the name of this arranger. It's a ditty that has been ringing in my head for the last 45 years. Okay, now, if you don't know the arranger or if this makes no sense to you, I'll explain it later. Okay? But yell out the name of the arranger as soon as you hear it, okay? Ready? They're the only ones laughing. U.S. Army. Yeah, you got to be a member of the tribe. It's a yeah. Huge, it's, it's, it's the chauffeur. <laughs> and that's a year's worth of training. A year. All right, everybody have dinner. Have a good time. <laughs>